Hello, welcome to Lebanon. I'm Rod Sell, the board president for Build Lebanon Trails, a local nonprofit whose goal is to help the city build 50 miles of trails that are proposed in their trails plan. So today, we get to go tour the existing 12 miles of trails. We want to invite you to come and enjoy them yourself. So this is my co-pilot for today's ride. This is Luna, man's best friend. She's going to make sure that I make all the right turns and go the right places. Today, we're starting on the south end of Lebanon at Chi Lake Park, which is the city's largest park. We're going to ride all the way to the north end of town to River Park. Along that route, we're going to be visiting Chi Lake, other greenways and waterways, and we're going to be going by the South San Juan River. So here at Chi Lake Park, there's a, roughly uh, about a mile to two miles worth of trails, and in the next two years, there's going to be many, many more trails. Uh, the city of Lebanon got a grant for uh, about $3 million to be able to build more trails and more accessibility. That's the one thing I wanted to share, too, about all the trails, that the paved trails and the concrete trails that we have in the community, is they're all fully accessible, and they access... Uh, several different parks along the route so they're very family friendly because they're 10 and 12 foot wide and there's bathrooms at regular intervals all the way through the ride today. Chi Lake Trail is a, a major part of the trail's plan and over the years we've been adding uh, sections of, of that trail. Today we're going to start out at the park but it transitions right into the North Shore Trail which uh, you know, goes along the north shore of Cheetah Lake, but also on a dike in between the canal that, uh, that's called the Albany Lebanon Canal and Cheetah Lake. On the lake is going to be the Island Loop Trail, and the Island Loop Trail is a paved trail that goes out on what we're calling fingers, but they're actually peninsulas out into the lake. And it's just a beautiful area that the Bill Levin Trails has done a lot of work on over the years, including planting trees. Today's trip will take us on the North Shore Trail to the north side of the lake, where we change over to the West River Trail. And the West River Trail goes behind some housing developments, but all in within a greenway, and ends up at the South San Juan River at Riverview Park. Riverview Park is right on the South San Juan River. It has a gravel trail that goes around the park there. From the West River Trail, it's connected right onto the Old Mill Trail. The Old Mill Trail was built by Bill Lebanon Trails two years ago, and it's a concrete 12 foot wide trail that has lighting all the way along. It also has what's called the Eagle Scout Trail, which is a soft surface trail that runs between the Old Mill Trail and the South San Juan River. So, that old mill trail then ends at uh, Gill's Landing. So that trail, as we head farther towards the north of the community, it goes to River Park. And River Park, we have a, a current uh, grant that's been approved through Oregon State Parks to extend the West River Trail through the River Park and uh, include a 3,000 foot long loop within the park. The real exciting news for us is uh, Bill Lebanon Trails is secured uh, right away along the Greenway. It's called the Old Mill Race. That's going to be built in 2024, 2025. We're currently raising funds for that project. And that project is going to take us all the way to the north end of town, to the neighborhoods of Row Mill and East Isabella Street, and very close to the Lebanon City Library. And another full trail system is called the Mark Slough Trail. That's uh, all the way on the north side of town by Tennessee Road. So our trail system has got several trailheads that you can access. Today, we're starting at the south of town off of Wyrick Road, which is Cheetah Lake Park. A lot of parking here at it's, it's all free parking. There's no, no charge for using the park. And uh, on the north end of Cheetah Lake Park off a of river road, there's a trailhead there and a large parking lot and where the boat ramp is. For It's a non-motorized uh, access to the lake. And then you go to Riverview Park, which is the next stop. There's another major parking lot there and trailhead. And you go farther north on the Old Mill Trail to where it hits Gill's Landing. Gill's Landing is another major parking area and a trailhead. And then just uh, north of that is the River Park, where there's a, a new picnic shelter there and several several uh, riverside uh, small picnic shelters and a bathroom facility. For more information on the Lebanon Trail system, we invite you to visit our website at buildlebanontrails.com. There you're going to be able to get the maps of the trail system. You're going to be able to find descriptions of the trail system, ways to donate, and ways to volunteer. There's many ways to volunteer for Build Lebanon Trails, but the biggest and probably most important part is we want to have fun. We do have fun. Every one of our work days, every one of our work projects is all about uh, being with friends and meeting new friends and being able to contribute and have fun and we do hey thank you for joining us in this trail adventure today uh, luna you think they should come visit our trails yep i know she does keep checking back in because we're building new trails every year we've got some great trail projects coming up this year and next that are going to extend this wonderful trail system even farther so take care and happy trails